This day brings together two separate families and backgrounds and creates a new union that is a sign of hope and joy for the future. Today, Luke and Rebecca will formally and publicly make their promises to one another. He isn't going to quote poetry. He's not thinking about you every moment, but he will give you a part of him that he knows you can break. Don't hurt him, don't change him, and don't expect for more than he can give. Don't analyze, smile when he makes you happy because perfect guys don't exist. But there's always one guy that is perfect for you. Sing and dance together and be joyous, but let each of you be alone, even as the strings of a lute are alone, though they quiver with the same music. Give your hearts, but not into each other's keeping, for only the hand of life can contain your hearts. And stand together, yet not too near together, for the pillars of the temple stand apart, and the oak tree and the cypress grow not in each other's shadows. You truly will never quite comprehend how proud it makes me feel to tell people you're my partner, now wife. You completely understand me, my mood, my energy like no one ever has. You have a very unique way of calming me if needed. You get my dry and sometimes mean sense of humour. You make me feel so secure and loved. I really cannot put into words how deep our connection is. I don't have many regrets in my life. But I will say, oh, I regret not having met you soon. Luke, I take you to be my husband. From this time onward. To join with you. To join with you. And to share all that is to come. To be a faithful wife. To give and to receive to inspire and to respond. A commitment made in love, kept in faith, and eternally made new. Deep down in my soul, I think I always knew that one day I would find you. I've never felt anything close to this kind of bliss before. In all of my years, the kind of internal peace that lights you up from the inside out. You are perfect balance to what I like to call my excitable personality. When my instinct is to bring the heat, you are always there looking back at me with a look on your face that says, Righto, that was interesting. Are you finished? I have never had anyone notice things about me quite like the way you do. You pick up on the way I say certain words, the funny little phrases I use regularly and the particular way I laugh when I'm either not really listening or I didn't find what you said to be particularly funny. The fact that you notice these things tell me that you really see me. You are present and it makes me feel so very loved. You have an amazing ability to make me feel like everything that is going on in my, my universe is important and worth your time. Whenever I'm feeling low, your instinct is to lift me up. I love the way you won't rest until my mood is lifted, insisting that we try to work out why I'm feeling the way that I do. I love the way that you love me. You are everything that my soul needs and you continue to delight me each and every day with new ways of making me feel loved and cared for. And all that I can wish for in this lifetime is that I make you feel just half as adored and appreciated as you do for me. Today I became your wife. A day I will never forget for as long as I live. One day soon, with a bit of luck, I will carry your beautiful baby. Our life will be exceptional. I know this for the fact, as it already is. You are my soul's perfect complement, and I can honestly say, for the first time in 36 years, my soul knows what it is to have quiet and peace. Rebecca, with this ring, I be wet. Take it and wear it as a constant reminder my love for you 
now and forever. Luke and Rebecca, with the exchange of vows and the giving of rings and the witnessing of these, your family and friends, with the power bestowed upon me, I now pronounce you husband and wife. You may now share your first kiss as husband and wife. <laughs>